United States Army must maintain a superior level of troop and material readiness that is necessary to protect the nation, its people, and its allies. This readiness involves the intensive training and conditioning of the soldiers whose missions are to defend the nation. The U.S. Army Armor Corps relies on the M1A2 main battle tank to serve as the backbone for their fighting forces. This is Fort Carson, home of America's 3rd ACR, Brave Rifles Regiment. Here in the Wild West, heavy metal takes on a whole new meaning. This is tank country, and the soldiers of the 3rd ACR take their business very seriously. When the 3rd ACR serves up business, it's usually in one of these babies, the M1A2 main battle tank, and you don't want to be on the receiving end. The M1A2 is a full-tracked, low-profile land combat weapon system. It possesses exceptional armor protection with highly lethal shoot-on-the-move firepower and excellent maneuverability and tactical agility. An M1A2 tank crew consists of the tank commander, gunner, loader, and driver. Together, it is the crew's responsibility to man, maintain, maneuver, and deliver maximum firepower on any specific target within the battlefield environment. Whether that environment be the cold dead of winter or the searing, dust-ridden heat of the desert sun, the crew must continually hone their individual and crew skills so that man and machine become one. M1A2 training is intensive and highly focused. It takes place 24 hours a day in classrooms, here on the tank, in field situations, and in realistic M1A2 simulators. This is the site of the M1A2 Advanced Gunnery Training System, AGTS. The AGTS was developed and produced by the Lockheed Martin Corporation for the United States Army. Its primary mission is to train individual crew and platoon gunnery skills to tank crews so that they can achieve and maintain a high state of combat readiness. The AGTS utilizes the most advanced computer and visual technologies available in cohesion with the U.S. Army and Lockheed Martin instructional crew and platoon training program. The AGTS provides high-fidelity, realistic, and cost-effective training on seven high-resolution databases. The AGTS crew station and site assembly components provide detailed replication of real tank parts. Depending on the tactical situation, the AGTS can be deployed in mobile, relocatable, or permanent configurations. The AGTS can work as a standalone crew trainer device or be linked through distributed simulation technology to provide platoon level training and after action review capability. The AGTS maintains concurrency with the real tank software baselines through the use of the Abrams Common Software Library. Every man has his day and that day for a tanker is live fire on the range. That's when the true test of the man and the machine come together. The tank tables. There's no such thing as a bogey on the range. It's all or none. You have it or you don't. It's the closest thing to the real thing. And for the tanker, this is serious business. Live fire must be exact and precise on the real tank. And these skills can be finely tuned on the AGTS. Even in the dark of night on the tank, or as simulated in the AGTS. Qualification of Table 8 on the live fire range for a tank crew and Table 12 for a platoon is the ultimate measurement of the crew skill. And the most cost effective way to get there is through the AGTS. This proven approach to precision gunnery training has also been applied by the Lockheed Martin team to produce M60A3, M1A1, M2A2, and LAV-25 versions of advanced gunnery training systems. And the AGTS has been field tested and has received a stamp of approval by the soldiers who use it. Use it. 
And you too can fight to win.